All right, what up, what up, what up, what up? Hope everybody enjoying the week. Today's Wednesday. All right. Today I'm going to show you how to pass a drug test. Uh, This is just for a job. If you got your PO over there staring at your dick when you piss in or watch you when you in the stall, you SOL. For the most part, some shit called you pass. I'm not promoting this or guaranteeing it or anything, so don't sue me for this shit. I ain't tried it. Everyone else been telling me about this shit, so I'm going to try that shit. Last time I passed a drug test, you got to get a container like this. Like this shit right here say, I don't know, it's some crazy shit. It says high quality fetish urine available. I bought this shit at the gas station. So you can buy a, some piss test pass at a gas station out here in Georgia. 100% toxin free fetish urine, no mixing necessary, male or female compatible, includes two heating pads. That's how you pass the drug test and shit. These be like, yo, this shit wasn't hot enough. All right, so anyway, grab your U pass. You gotta get you a container. Even if you got somebody, if you a dude, you can't get a female to piss for you because it's going to show up that it's a female from her hormones and shit. Or else you got a period and this and that. Alright. So you got to find if you can find a dude that don't smoke get his piss. This is a container you kind of need. Now anyone going to be mad at me for this. It ain't got to be M1. Sorry M1. But it gotta be some kind of spandex shit like this. That's crazy. This might be the one I used on the last one. See, I had sewed this shit up. It's kind of you can't see that shit when you take it, but I had sewed it up to kind of close to make sure this shit ain't fall out. <laughs> you know, I ain't even. But anyways, you put. Put the motherfucker in. I had the skinnier one last time. Hold on. Yoink. <coughs> I have to bust that shit. You put the motherfucker in. Damn. All right. Let's see if I can get this damn shit in there. I had sewed it up too tight. This is from the last one. And I had the, the last one was like more of a cylinder shape and shit. It wasn't. Let me get it in there though. Motherfucking virgin. Oh, virgin. Alright, so basically, you get it in there, right? Hell no. Shit ain't supposed to slip out. What's the point of sewing if that shit slips out? Where the hell did it slip out from? Alright, so anyway. Yo, that's crazy as fuck. Alright. I'm going to bust this shit open. Don't sew that shit up, so fuck it. Sew that shit up away. All right, so basically, how you do it, <coughs> put it in your drawers, and it's like a little pocket right here. And you want to keep it in that pocket. And it's sitting. If you get some da 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 das and shit, fucking the pocket. This, like the bottom, you, you sitting, you tuck that shit under your nuts, and you sit on it. That way it's going to heat up. The U-Pass, the U-Pass come with the heat warmers. You wrap that bitch around it. Huh. It come with a rubber band. Y'all bear with me. When it's time to go, y'all get the heat warmers, wrap that bitch up, put the rubber band around that shit. I know some of the homies just go with that shit in their pocket like, fuck it. But me personally, nigga put that shit in your motherfucking drawer, sit on that bitch, 
you gonna feel it, you gonna have to play it off. Like, yo, I just got, I got some shit tucked in. I'm gonna fucking play that shit off. But, boom, they put you in that room, pass that drug test, pull this bitch out. It's gonna, it's gonna be warm enough. They're gonna show you the degrees. Pour that shit in shit. Boom, get that shit to the motherfucking, to the people. Boom, there you go. Pass your drug test. All right. My bad I be all over the place, but I hope that shit will get you through that shit, man. Go get that bread.